All right. So next up, I have some sago worms. You've probably seen them if you watch any kind of survival shows. It's the kind of thing you'd see on Man vs. Wild. The actually the larva of the red palm weevil, and they're native to. Southeast Asia, I believe. Mostly, but they've really spread. They're a pest in palm trees. And pretty much anywhere palm trees can be found, they've spread to North America, Africa, and at least in Africa and Southeast Asia, they're considered a delicacy. Or a really important food source, so it's not that huge of a deal that they're a big pest, but here in the Western world, it's a big problem to have these guys eating up all the palm trees. They're actually been promised to be quite large. I don't know how many are in here, but they feel like they have some heft in them, especially relative to other larvae. I can go ahead and cut this open. And I end up with a cricket leg in there. in there. Something floating around. Alright, so got four of them here. And again, they're boiled and dehydrated. So not quite as fat as they would be. You can actually see it's all sucking in. Quite the head on that thing. Camera won't auto focus. Nothing really to do now, but I don't remember if these were seasoned with anything in particular. No, just salt. They are eaten raw a lot. I've seen lots of videos of people eating them raw. It's still squirming around. I don't know if I'd want to do that. I tend to not care for larva that much. It's kind of earthy. Not really like a a mushroom. Can't really think of anything to compare it to.
it says they're only seasoned with salt. I'm getting a little bit of spiciness. I don't know if that's from the larva itself or something it ate, or if they did actually season it with something other than salt. Now, I think, like the, uh, the giant water bugs, this is one of those things that you would have to try fresh to really form a good opinion of it. I mean, it's not bad. But there isn't really much to it, especially dried. And definitely not like fresh when they're quite large. I would, I would give these a try if I were you. If you can get them fresh, especially if you have a chance to travel in Asia or Africa, or if you get down into the uh, like California or possibly Florida. I don't remember where all they range within the U.S. But if you get somewhere where palms are really common, you might be able to get some there. Go ahead, maybe fry them up fresh. See how the flavor is that way. I think I've heard them described as having a kind of a bacon flavor in the fresh and fried. I can see that being the case. So yeah, sago worms. Go try them.